Hey, this is Tyler with Raxofish, and this is going to be another fish update. We're starting off today in the 5 gallon guppy tank. I ended up grabbing these two, they're a breeding pair and they are so pretty. All we have to do is get them acclimated to the water temperature. The one with the big colorful tail is the male and the other one's the female. And after about 15 minutes or so, it's time to put them in. The nice thing with guppies is they pretty much get along all the time. You don't have to really worry about too much. They immediately took to the tank and have been doing really good. Next update is on my 30 gallon aquarium. We're going to be adding this gourami I got from my friend Tim. His spots and patterns are really awesome, he's a gorgeous fish. This here is actually how gourami say hi to each other, they take their front little tentacle things and just tap on the other fish. You can see a small nip out of this flame Garami's fin. This happened before I got the big Garami and it's because of this blue one here. But he also has a nip on his fin so they must be going back and forth. We're gonna have to take him out and put him in a different tank. The 6 gallon curve tank is pretty understocked so we're gonna be putting him in here. We're just gonna be using a little bit of stress coat to help with this move. He was extremely stressed at first sadly so we're gonna be turning off the light to help with this. And later on that evening he was swimming around checking out the other fish not too noticeable but you can see some spots where the blue is missing on his fins where they were nipping at him. This is extremely sad to see, I just hope he does better in here. It's actually been a few days and he's been doing really good in this tank, I know he's going to make a full recovery. That also means it's been a few days for the guppies too. They've been doing really good in here and look awesome with the other fish. I'm actually working on a new build, so I moved the guppy tank to the bottom of this other rack and put a black backing on the back of the tank. This is the same stuff I used on the back of the 30 gallon tank and it looks really good. Speaking of the 30 gallon, after these few days, the grommy that we put in here has been doing a lot better. And ever since we moved the dwarf powder blue grommy to the 6 gallon tank, all the aggression issues we had have stabilized out. The next small update is on the 5 gallon betta tank. She's been doing really good since the incident with the other betta and has almost made a full recovery. Thank you guys a lot for checking out my fish update and I'll catch you guys in the next one.